All right, so first things first, shout out DNA, get money, drink water, merch is fire, go cop that. I want to bring into discussion um, talks of big matchups that I don't feel as though people are actively speaking about, um, at least not, you know, too openly and too frequently on YouTube, um, but I feel as though my personal opinion just off of like worth, uh, work ethic and stuff like that. If, whether they happen or not, it's not under my control, but I feel as though people should at least consider it and give these guys the respect to say that, you know what, they deserve those matchups. So, when it comes to battle rap, we already know. Loaded Lux um, and Murder Mook are like the Mount Olympus of, you know, matchups. You know, they're like the Zeus and Hades and, 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 and uh, Poseidon. They're like the God level, you know, matchups. Um... Disaster for the West Coast, or like KOTD, he's like God level on KOTD. But when it comes to like battle rap as a whole, Disaster is not at that level. Respect to him, but you know he's not at that level. If I'm being all the way honest. Also, Hollow, Hollow is at a certain like Mount Olympus level, but Hollow is much more accessible and willing to battle other people uh, and on a, a wide variety of people than Lux and Mook. So. Hollow is at that level, but he just doesn't make himself, like, have that type of level requirement to battle you. You know what I'm saying? Um, but Lux and Mook, man, I feel as though two, well, three guys, but the two guys I really want to talk about. I'm going to say the third one just because JC. JC, I've been saying, you know, to, for Lux to battle him since but when I was at Vlad TV. Um, I've tried to, you know, promo that. When I was doing uh, heavy independent battle rap work, you know, like four years ago on my channel and stuff like that. I've even spoke about it more recently as well. Lux, uh, I think recently there was like reports that he turned it down. He's not trying to battle JC. Lux, my opinion, bro, you still got to battle JC. The two guys who I would like to see battle, honestly, both guys, is DNA versus Loaded Lux and Murder Mook. And um, also Danny Myers versus Loaded Lux and Murder Mook. Um, people could, you know, try to flame you. You wildin', DNA, that's no, that's light work. Danny Myers, you wildin'. You know, if, if, if your argument for DNA and Danny Myers not battling Loaded Lux and Murder Mook is the fact that they battle everyone, that is the biggest easy to block captain. Bullshit! <laughs> Bullshit! Bullshit arguments you can make. How are you gonna tell me that two dudes who battle everyone from the elite level, right below the Mount Olympus, you know, reputation at least. Reputation-wise, Lux and Mooker at Mount Olympus. But when it comes to skill, do all the other homies that are, you know, top level, they Mount Olympus level of skill. It's just reputation and, you know, the, 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 the weight that their name holds may not be that. But how are you going to tell me that two dudes who will battle anyone from the ground all the way up, and just because people be at the ground... Dudes, they don't mean they trash, you know what I'm saying? It's just their name isn't known. But how are you going to tell me that dudes who, these two guys who will battle anyone from the old era to the new era and put in work aren't worthy of at least being talked about battling Luxembourg? How? We already know DNA can take a battle within five minutes and still potentially, prop not potentially, he can still make it debatable and arguably win off of just freestyle. Facts. DNA is a savage. Danny Myers, um, I'm not going to say that he could maybe do the same thing when it comes to freestyling, but let's give Danny Myers a day or two prep. He could make the battle debatable, potentially win that. You know what I'm saying? Like, both dudes are, when it comes to elite, elite, elite. And their work ethic, man. And if y'all want to try to argue, oh, you know, uh, uh, Danny Myers choked recently on snack for the, uh, what was it, for the, uh, the Jerry West battle. So what, bro? When you battle 100 plus 200 times and you choke once or twice, it happens. <laughs> it happens. If you had Mook and Lux battle as frequently as these, as these dudes do, they would have some uh, super shaky performances as well. You know what I'm saying? I feel as though people got to put a little bit more respect on uh, DNA and Danny Meyer's name. And I personally would like to see. I feel as though they deserve those battles. When you put up, you know... Um, 
Lux and Mook have both both kind of said this on like in various interviews in the past. Lux said uh, said one with me when I was trying to promote him uh, versus uh, with a battle versus JC when me and Norbs interviewed him in like 2017. He was like, "What if what has a person done outside of battle rap?" Um, Danny Myers, you know, outside of battle rap, I respectfully I can't necessarily put him like, "Yo, he's done this, this, this." You know what I'm saying? He's he's just been one of those dudes who's put battle rap on his back. And put in work in the trenches in battle rap. DNA has done it. Oh, we notice. DNA's been on ESPN. He's been featured in like like the WWE, WWF, whatever, WrestleMania, stuff like that. He's uh been um shouted out by 50 Cent on like his Instagram for like his power um um freestyles and stuff like that. Like He's he's done mad stuff, bro. Mad stuff. DNA's done like tournaments of this. Reality shows that all types of stuff. Like like DNA when it comes to what has he done for battle rap? Respectfully, you could. I mean, no, granted, again, when it comes to their name, Lux and Mook's uh, names hold more weight from just being part of like the Genesis eras. But DNA has arguably done more for battle rap than both of them. If we keeping it a buck. Outside of battle rap is what I'm talking about as well. Not just, you know, putting battle rap. Because DNA been on the trenches since day one. Since grind time and all that stuff. Since before Smack. You know what I'm saying? I remember watching DNA battle. Who who he battle? He battled like Lil Farnham. <laughs> Yo, I remember I used to, when I interviewed DNA at, at Vlad TV, I used to call like, re like reflect on like his old ass grind time battles and dna was just like damn bro like you was really watching these shits like Lil farnum and like throwback names that you don't hear about no more bro he been putting in work since forever and let's not act like they ain't beat some of the best dudes out there i don't know man that's just me personally i just feel like you could jump into the drama talks and stuff like that i'm trying not to necessarily uh dive into all of the the battle rap drama that be kind of like loving hip-hop but battle rap edition these days because that was one of the things that i hated about vlad tv that you would just kind of go home on, on certain days and other of my ex-coworkers they used to say the same thing to me so i'm not just bugging you go home and your, your mind state of mind is kind of in a negative headspace because you're just covering drama and like negative topics 24 7 from the moment you clock in and you type in you're doing interviews all that, you know what I'm saying? So I try personally not to necessarily dive into the drama and the love of hip hop, reality TV um, discussions. Because it's going on. Battle rap is crazy right now with the drama. Crazy. But you notice, like, I don't really, when I'm posting content, I'm not really trying to talk about that. And if, if, it gets, if I sacrifice views because I'm not talking about the drama, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather talk about, you know, things that can help promote people towards a bigger bag. You feel me? Like DNA and Danny Myers. Versus Loaded Lux, Murder Move. If you, the two on two, they could do that. But I would love to see them both get a one on one with both of those dudes. Let me know what y'all think, man. Do y'all think that DNA and or Danny Myers have put in enough work and are worthy of a battle, a one on one battle, not just the two on two, but a one on one battle versus Loaded Lux and Murder Move, both, not just one of them. And um, yeah, do you think they put enough work? And do y'all want to see that? And also, who do you think will win? Let me know.